Welcome back to TMZ Hollywood Sports. Evan here as we get closer and closer to the fight of the century. Mayweather versus Pacquiao. Both guys are going deep into the bag of tricks to try and figure out ways to get an advantage over the other guy. Well, Floyd Mayweather is doing something straight out of Demolition Man. He's ah. using cryotherapy. He does this religiously, and he believes it helps him relieve him of like aches and pains and really gets him in prime fighting shape. And to really find out a little bit more about this, because honestly, I don't really know too much about this. I've never done cryotherapy before, but we got the guy who runs the shop. We have David Levy with us right now from Sub-Zero Recovery in Las Vegas. David, thanks for joining us on TMZ Hollywood Sports, man. How are you doing? Doing great. So, uh, look, I've never been cryotherapized before. Tell me about this. <laughs> so basically, we have uh, this machine that you see behind me here, and uh, we drop the temperature in there to negative 180 degrees Fahrenheit, and that's when we get somebody in the machine. So we'll have Floyd jump in the machine at negative 180. We leave him in there for two to three minutes, and it, the temperature will drop down to negative 220, and by doing that, it recovers his body after his hard workouts. He usually comes very late at night every single day after his workouts. Yeah. Wow. Wait, so does it feel freezing cold on your skin? It's very, very cold, but you're not wet, so it's not like the same as getting in an ice bath where you're wet and soaking afterwards. It's like a dry cold, so as soon as you get out, your body warms right back up again. David, I'm sure it still feels freezing. I hate the cold. A lot of people hate the cold. How does Floyd <laughs> handle that? Floyd is definitely... Very sensitive to cold. He does not like the cold. He 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 deals with it though. He pushes through it because he knows it's the biggest fight of his career, and he's really pushing himself more than I've seen him in any other fight. What does this actually do to to help your to help your body? I know it it feels better, but what's the science? So the science behind it is that it basically tricks your body uh, into survival mode. So it sends like all the blood from your arms and legs to your core to protect your organs to keep your organs warm. So that short period of coldness from two to three minutes, as soon as you jump out, that blood goes flows back out to your body and it has a bunch of nutrients that it picked up from your organs. So now it's helping you recover, your muscles are recovering, your joints are recovering. It ends up burning 500 to 800 calories wow. every time wow. you get there, and wow. it also speeds up your metabolism. I need that machine. Oh, well, I can't wait to see uh, you know, how this affects Floyd in the ring. We're less than two weeks away already. I mean, fair to yeah. say that you're gonna be uh, your, your team Mayweather here? Absolutely, absolutely I'm team Mayweather. I'm rocking with the money team for this fight. And I think you'll see a great performance. I think you'll see one of the best performances you've seen out of Floyd. Uh, you know, in years now because he's been able to recover so quickly after every workout. Oh, wow, so awesome. oh, there you go. Awesome. Is there a connection between cryotherapy and also the cryopreservation thing like Ted Williams had? <laughs> no, we cannot do that here. <laughs> so oh, wait, 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 real quick to that. But what about like cryo prisons like in Demolition Man? Yeah, that's right. We put people under for like 30 years or something like that. Can you guys do that? I hope not. I hope Wesley Snipes does not show up over there. No, I do not want to <laughs> Dude, David, thanks for joining us on TMZ Hollywood Sports. It's a pleasure to talk to you. Thanks for having me. All right, that's going to do it for us here today at TMZ Hollywood Sports. We've got more great stuff for you tomorrow, including Steven Seagal almost beats up a real UFC star. Actually, twisted him around pretty bad. We'll have that for you tomorrow on TMZ Hollywood Sports.